It is no secret. We love our parks in Denver. But like everything else, the pandemic is making a mess out of their budget and at some of the parks. Denver 7's Ivan Rodriguez shows us what's now missing. Throughout the city of Denver's parkways like this one on 6th Avenue, you'll typically see people running or walking with their dog. People use it on a regular basis. My kids run on it all the time. It's enjoyed by everybody around here. But now Denver Parks and Recreation will be scaling back their maintenance on all parkways, and they've already removed all the dog poop trash cans. Not shocking at all, given what the economy is going through. The department says one of the big reasons, staffing and cuts to the city's budget. Traditionally, we hire between 180 to 200 seasonal on-call workers. That means they come on about March and they work through October. This year we hired about 80, so about 45% of the workforce that we traditionally have was hired. Scott Gilmore with Denver Parks and Recreation says the number of people visiting parks this year has skyrocketed, so they're using the manpower they do have to focus on them instead of parkways. Obviously, the less you leave behind, the less that has to be maintained. But others think people will just end up leaving trash along the parkway. I don't even like to pick up the dog poop, so um, I always get my kids to pick up the dog poop. Uh, that's one of the conditions of getting the dogs, but then, you know, what do you do with it? Where do you, where do you carry it? Where do you throw it? If people can travel, to Rocky Mountain National Park and take their dog out there and pick up the poop there and pack it in and pack it out. They should be able to pack it in and pack it out of the parkway in their neighborhood. Other things like mowing the grass on parkways will still get done, just not as often. As the city moves into 2021, this is a small indication of needed changes due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Ivan Rodriguez, Denver 7.